Hi, I'm Leon Poindexter, and here we are working on the Boston Tea Party ships. Uh, since the last time we met, we've been doing quite a bit of work on the ships. And uh, if we take a look around here, I'll show you what we've been up to. Well, what we're doing here is we're preparing to build the bulwarks. The bulwarks is a continuation of the hull. We're going from the whale up to the deck line. This is the deck here. And then we continue up the hull to about three feet above the deck line. And this will all be planked in. One of the distinctive features of vessels of this period is this rather unique shape. Uh, the vessel actually does a little bit of a tumble home, which means that the hull curves around a little bit more as it goes towards the rail cap, which is going to be about at this level here. One thing that's really important is we have to fare all this in. So all of this has to be a nice smooth curve and we have to work this in all the way up. And that's what John's working on now. When we get this all fair, then we'll start planking. And the planking will be about seven inches wide and we'll start up uh, from the covering board up to the rail cap. The plank stock for the bulwark is going to be recycled heart pine. This material came from the old factory buildings that were torn down. And this is actually some of the best uh, material that you can get. This stock was basically used up by the early part of this century. Uh, so the only place it's available is out of these old factory buildings. The nice thing about this stuff is that it's very stable. Uh, it has plenty of pitch and it lasts a long time. And as you can see here, the ring count is very tight and this makes for some premium lumber. Uh, the only thing is we've got a few uh, gouges, we've got a few holes, but on a vessel like this, it's very easy to repair those and we use it uh, all the time on old restorations. Well, today it's perfect shipbuilding weather, but uh, lately we've had some pretty nasty weather. Uh, we've had four or five inches of rain the last week, and uh, we've had to rig up a lot of uh, covers and tents and things over the boat so we can keep working. Also on rainy days, we have to shift from what we're doing on the outside of the vessel to something down below or even working in the shop. I'm working here on the windows, uh, on the transom of the boat. We work year round, we have to suffer through the summer so we get to enjoy the nice snowy winters. And uh, in between we get the rain and we do what we have to. So throw up a, throw up a tarp, throw an old sail up, what have you. Uh, put it up so that you can keep on working. Um, mostly we don't, need the, we don't need the protection, we just don't want our tools to rust. As you can see over my shoulder, work is continuing on the beaver. Uh, so check back with us a little later and we'll see another episode.